Have you ever felt like or gotten feedback that, hey, too much information in your presentation? This is not uncommon. In fact, this is the biggest problem I see with speeches and stories. Oh, an overload of information and not enough insight, not enough audience interaction, and certainly not enough questions. So speaking of questions, here's one that you can ask both yourself and the people who evaluate you that will help you cut excess information, excess stories, excess data out of your talks. Here's the question. Have I already made my point? Well, when I'm talking about storytelling, I talk about the various elements. You've got to have an opening that grabs attention and sets the stage, gives the everyday life of the main character. I don't need to give three examples. I often see this with people. They'll give two, three, four examples, and it's like, hey, the point's already been made. As you're going through your material, for each sub-point that you're trying to make, ask yourself the question, is the point made? Is this next example this next story, this next set of data that I'm about to present, is it just redundant? I share this with you because I don't believe that audiences have an attention problem today. They don't. If you think that people have an attention deficit issue, go watch a child playing video games. They don't lack attention, do they? They're laser focused. Go watch friends or maybe think about yourself binge watching shows on Netflix or Apple TV. Do you have an attention problem when you're watching those shows? Absolutely not. You're engrossed. The reason that people lose attention during our presentations is we're giving them too much information and often it's redundant. So ask yourself and ask your evaluators this question. Has the point been made? Can I cut out the rest so I can move on to the next point? Try this out. It'll make a big difference in the impact of your next presentation.